This conference will now be recorded. Hey guys, this is Naveen here. Welcome back to Naveen Automation Labs. So, in the continuation of Selenium 4 series, today I have come up with very something very interesting thing that a uh, couple of people are asking that, okay, this feature is already available in Selenium 3, then why we are saying that uh, this feature is recently introduced in Selenium 4? Let's see this element get a screenshot as method right get a screenshot as method for web elements available in selenium 4 but it is visible in selenium 3 also same thing in the previous video i told you that how to take uh, height and width x and y coordinate with the help of get rectangle method which is recently introduced in selenium 4 but why it is visible in selenium 3 also right so there is a reason behind that that is what i'll uh, i'll tell you because in fact a couple of people are asking they are claiming that okay no it's this these kind of these methods are already available in selenium 3 then why are you saying that uh, these feature they recently introduced uh, in selenium 4 it's already available in selenium 3 so no it's not available already available in selenium 3 there is a reason behind that why it is visible in selenium 3 so what i'll show you that uh, first i'll tell you what exactly i'm trying to explain so what exactly I'm saying that is, let's see, there are uh, some features. Let's see this get rectangle feature and uh, and this uh, web element take, taking the screenshot. And there are two versions. This is Selenium 3 and this is Selenium 4.x, right? Whatever the 4.x alpha version you are using and this is uh, 3.x alpha version we are using. So these three, uh, these features are available. These are the new features are available in Selenium 4.x, but these uh, features got merged and tagged with selenium 3 also i'll prove you how to do okay where exactly it is so that's why whenever you are using 3.141 that is the recent uh, the latest version is 3.141.59 which is released in december 2000 uh december 2018 i guess yeah december 2018 introduced so we all are using the latest stable version this and in this particular uh, uh, selenium also we are able to see these two versions why there is a reason behind that that i'll explain you in this particular video and obviously in 4.x alpha 1 and alpha 2 and alpha 3 it's also available right so actually it got tagged over here the code is also merged in the form of patches but they are they haven't bump up the version it means it's not like 3.141.60 is available no in the same version they haven't increased the version number but in the same version these features are tagged it means these features are available in the master branch of 3.141.59 in their github repository and that's where we are able to see those methods okay so let's see how exactly this is working so that's uh, my understanding and let's see how exactly so first i'll show you in, uh, what exactly i'm trying to say this is the uh, see this is the pom.xml file in this particular project and you go to pom.xml file and uh, uh, this 4.alpha3 I have already added as a dependency and you open this particular method this method I'm talking about this user.get screenshot as method which is which was earlier not available in selenium 3 it recently introduced in selenium 4 only but if you are using selenium 3.141.59 dependency also this method is available over there as well that's a confusion is coming that okay why these methods are visible over there okay i'll tell you why first of all you see the description capture the screenshot and store in the specified location for a w3c conformant web driver or web element this behavior as stated in this particular uh, on this particular page like this right okay now this is basic thing selenium 4 we have already seen that now i'll show you in selenium 3 so let's see i'll take uh, any previous projects so let's see i'll take something this one okay this is the project you open this pom.xml file and in this particular pom.xml file you see that uh, this is a different project this is selenium 3.14.59 right and the same method i'll check somewhere let's see i'll open any any file let's see locator I have already created some locator concept and here you will see that uh, I have created this particular web element around the same web element I will try to use that method that you can see get screenshot as method is available okay this is the method get a screenshot as method is available already available over here right you can see that now 
if you see that get rec method also is available this is the get rec method is also available and the same get rec method is available over here as well okay you can apply get rec also and then get a screenshot method is already available over here and you see that okay get a screenshot method is available over here as well in selenium 4 also let me show you see this is the method i'm talking about you can see this method is available over here as well right <clears throat> but if you notice one thing over here in get a screenshot as method is there so you see this is a get a screenshot as method is there okay let me show you like this dot get a screenshot as you can see the description over here but here they haven't written anything specific to w3c because w3c is available inside okay with selenium 4 but in selenium 3 they are they have changed the description something like this but this feature is available in selenium 3 also okay now i'll show you how now we go to their github repository so you see the difference right this is the problem is there i mean not problem exactly this is the uh, this is the puzzle that we are trying to solve. Why it is visible in Selenium 3. Now we will go to their GitHub repository. So this is github.com. Okay, you go to Selenium HQ Selenium and you click on this Selenium. And here different uh, language wise repository and <coughs> uh, code base is available. We will go to Java. And here in Java, you go to client. And over here, you go to SRC. Uh, you don't go to with ThoughtWorks. We go to with OpenQA Selenium and uh, you go to this particular <coughs> this web java and here you will see this web java is actually extending take a screen okay short interface okay this is the interface name so get uh, take a screenshot interface is available and this this guy i'll show you where exactly that this this is the interface is available and this guy is having that particular method you can see get a screenshot as method is available over here okay so that's why and you can see all the w3c confirmed development and all those things are visible over there fine okay now we will go to selenium so right now whatever we have seen that is selenium the latest code latest code is available in their master branch now we will go to the release 119 releases and here you will see that 3.141.5 uh, men was the official latest release in December 20th, December 2018. Right? And here you will not see that, okay, any take a screenshot or web element method is already, web element take a screenshot or get rectangle method or switch to parent frame method or any method is available over here. No. Right? Okay. And the release note also, it's not there. But why it is visible there in the code? So you just go to this one, three, uh, let's see, four, two commits. And you will see the commit history and some other things. So you go to file changed. Okay, you go to file changed. And uh, in file change, you just simply press control F and then search for takes. Um, let's see. Okay, take, take profile, take screenshot.java right this is the take a screenshot on java and this is you can see in the url guys i'm i'm looking into 3.141 master branch okay and you just click on this load diff and you will see that something over here you can see take a screenshot for web element they have introduced right so earlier it was with the driver okay the driver is also available now they have added this Green, green color means the plus means they have added this particular line okay and then indicates a driver that can capture a screenshot and it's saying indicates a driver or an html element that can capture a screenshot and store in a different way it means you now you can take the screenshot okay of an html web element also right okay and then here you will see this is public interface take a screenshot method is available <clears throat> and this method is okay the complete description they have given over here like this right and complete w3c conformant and all those things i'm looking into see selenium 3.14.5 man only right okay now you do one thing you click on these three dots and click on view file okay you click on view file and then in the view file also you will see that particular method is available over here i'm still into 3.141 guys okay 
and then you go to history. You click on history and over here, the recent history last year around 2017, but latest one is 30th June 2019. Okay, 30th June 2019 and you click on it. And the developer is this guy. Okay, Baron Siv. Okay, so this guy is available. I can show you this guy. Okay. And uh, so we go back. And then here you can see that this guy has actually added number of uh, lines, three major change, three change files with 188 additions, 56 deletions. Okay, in 3.141.59. You can see that. Okay, the web element. You can see. Okay, the complete thing available over here. Right, and this method also some W3C uh, guidelines, comments also these guys, okay, they have written. And you just click on split, okay. And here you will see the split. So this is this was the older version of 3.141.59. And after uh, Selenium 4 Alpha 1, they re uh, released this how to take a screenshot, right, for a web event. Now you can see the difference. So this is the latest 3.141, the right hand side section, and this is the older version. And you can clearly see the difference. Earlier, we were having, <clears throat> uh, okay, we were not having any method for taking the screenshot for web element. Now you can see that they have all these green color lines, they have added the take a screenshot method over here, right? You can see all the methods, all the new lines added over here, okay, in this particular, in this particular interface class. Okay, in this particular interface file, you can see that over here as well. Right, guys? So this is the basic uh, difference. You can clearly visible, it's clearly visible over here. Okay, you click on unified, and then here you will see, yeah, this is the thing it's added over here, right? Like this. So all the description, all the comment section they have added, and uh, you can actually view the complete file also. And then you will see that the code also you can see, this is the <clears throat> method they have added, which will throw a web driver exception. Right, guys? So this is Selenium 3 version, which is actually having the code of Selenium 4. Okay, some code is actually added with Selenium 3 also, so that you guys can use it with Selenium 3. Because they feel that, okay, that is my understanding. They feel that, okay, yeah, this, Maybe this particular feature is quite stable. So let's introduce with Selenium 3 also so that people can use it in Selenium 3 as well. Okay, so I think according to me, that's the reason. And I've already proved in front of you guys, okay, looking into their main repository. <clears throat> and that's the main reason behind that. Guys. Okay, so this is what I actually really wanted to show. And what do you think about this particular uh, thing? And what's maybe if you have a different understanding, just please put it down, <clears throat> put your uh, understanding in the comment section. Let me know if you have some any other idea about it, or maybe if you have some other understanding about it. The main thing is why Selenium 4 features are visible in Selenium 3. That is the question. Okay. So cool. So that's all for today, this particular video, guys. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much.